Hello once again. Uh, this is a Setback Pro design tutorial. Uh, actually, uh, it's a special request from a uh, board mate, Jerry Teo. So, just uh, I'm gonna run this tutorial in two, two, uh, two presentations. The first one is actually not a road design, but um, just create a flat pad for it for the road. And then the next one would be the actual road design itself. Um, in this tutorial, I'll yeah, basically create a flat pad for the offices. I'll create the contours. Uh, in that, I'll use uh, create contours and I'll clip the strings by a boundary string. Mm. All that function used will be segment edit functions, trim by selected segment, I'll clip and match the strings. Okay. Um, basically, I'll start off setback. Uh, these are the old like it. This is um, I'll, I'll create a raw design folder here. So basically, this is my stock file from the stock file tutorial. This is my waste dump from the waste dump tutorial. And I want to basically in this tutorial, I want to basically create a pad, flat pad here. And then I'll link a road all the way from here up to here. So the first part of the tutorial will be to create a flat pad up here. What I do is um, I'll go, I have to create a contour, and then I'll clip the surfaces by the contour. So I'll show you how to do it. Go surfaces. I have to make. Uh, It is layer active layer. So just double click that. That's it. Okay, now I'll go to surfaces, contouring, and then I'll just simply contour DTM in the layer. And then it goes one to this. Normally make it to a whole number so it doesn't. Main minimum contour, the maximum contour, just leave it at that. Uh, I want it by 5 meter intervals. Then go, oh, I have to name the contour, so count of 5 meter. And go apply. So it's gonna give me the contour at 5 meters. Okay, that's good. Add my contours and freeze the arrow the layers. Um, let's save that. Sorry, I make this uh, contour layer active. Double click that and we'll save it. Type again contour. Check 5 meters. This is 5. And I've got 5 meter contours. So basically, when you look at the string, um, the layer, I want to create a flat pad uh, right on this. Okay, I'll make it on this. Um, this wipe one here. So I'll freeze the DTM. Mm. Then I'll create a new layer. So I copy this. Uh, I'm gonna make this a boundary string and then I use this uh, string to clip uh, my DTM. So actually I'll just um, create a new layer. I'll call it uh, PDR save that and then I'll just copy this uh, string into that copy segment sorry then I'll copy this okay when I freeze the contours I got this okay that's good I want to cut it off here so basically I use this um, function here break segment break uh, and this one here. 
delete the rest of it and then basically make this a closed polygon I click on uh, this one here and close the segment and it's closed that's my boundary created okay just do an ERTM Raise temporary markers okay I've got this I have to bring in my as build so I can take it that uh, looks ugly here that means that the style file is not in so I'll just style load and then find where my style file is i just pick that and then this lovely string comes on I'll just have to freeze the stop file and the uh, waste stamp I've got this I'll have it in plan view so I want to clip and make this the clip the pad. What I do is um, go edit segment. Sorry, go trim. Clip by selected segment. I want it outside. Sorry, inside. Apply. Okay, got it. That's that. I have to save that as a clip file. So I'll go remove the stop file. It's not the stop file anymore. Just uh, put the uh, road design. Two one one. CLP like that it's saved okay you have to get everything out and then bring them back in to match them so I'll just uh, click this so that refreshes everything I um, press on the control key while I bring the boundary pad and then I'll bring in the road design and the clip one. So that while holding the control key, cancel brings it into a one file. So I'll just save it as the road design one clip. Reset um, the graphics again. And then this time bring it in. Okay, and then just create a DTM from layer one and just take off the platform break line test once I'm done I've got a flat pad at the top so I can put up my workshop or offices up here but then how do I get up from here to here that will be the next tutorial where I show you how to do the road module and thanks again